need to know who Sunny's been in contact with. It's moments like this that the Jackal's awesome cyber dominance feels like a curse. According to Mr. Sir's phone records, he received three calls from the evil patriarch. Anthony offered Sonny to run his whole organization. And if that happens, there's going to be a war. Sorry. I really need Spinelli's help right now. Okay, Maxie, I, I, I really need Spinelli to focus. I really need that... him to help me, okay? I'm not known for my compassion, but it really got to me seeing Lulu stuck in Shady Brook. And if you want to help her, just let Spinelli come with me for a little bit. Yeah, the Jackal will continue to closely monitor that which will remain unmentioned in Max Mesa's presence. Fine, go. You guys go. Thank you. I promise I won't make him do anything you don't want him to do. Spinelli! <laughs> oh, No sign of the overzealous mental health enforcers. The master of stealth has succeeded in infiltrating. Certainly, there's not a whole lot of people trying to break into the loony bin. No offense. What are you guys doing back here? We came to prove to you that although you're not the most stable person on the planet, you're not completely bonkers, and you definitely didn't write those threatening notes to yourself. The jackal has availed himself of a handwriting analysis program designed by law enforcement. How did you get access to that? No system can outmatch the jackal. I mean, back to the subject at hand. Indeed, literally. <laughs> As real as your suffering is, Fair Lulu, and as varied its manifestations, it is not possible that you wrote this note yourself. Disorders are broken down into three different categories. Well, main categories. The first one is anxiety disorder, like phobias, such as irrational fears of situations or things. But like, like clowns, for, for, for instance, would strike fear into the most Stout-hearted of men. Spinelli. Okay, yeah, okay. Um, the, the next one is mood disorders, which is where your symptoms fall. D depression, fatigue, and in your case, I, I think an uncommonly big heart. See, I'm of the humble opinion that is your, it is your depth of care and sorrow which has led to emotional exhaustion or a mental breakdown, but there, there's no sign of psychotic disorder, which is the third and most dire category. No schizophrenia or... Multiple personality? I guess I should be thankful for small favors. Oh, the point is, Miss Sorrow and Pity, if this is your one and only personality, then you can't be using handwriting that's not yours, right? Yes, it is most unlikely. If the blonde ones would gaze at the program that I've brought up here, it's a comparison of your handwriting with that of the infamous note, okay? O observe the author's struggle to maintain verticality. See, the narrow and... The two samples of handwriting do not match. That's what I was saying, yes. So if Spinelli's right... Of course Spinelli's right, it's Spinelli. Oh my god. It means I'm not as crazy as I thought. Yeah, I'm reluctant to spoil one happy realization with one a little less felicitous, but it, it also means that someone is really trying to blackmail you. thinking about shaving at a time like this we're supposed to be helping Lulu figure out who's blackmailing yeah, I don't actually really have to shave that off no um Occam's razor is is a principle of logic attributed to a 14th century Franciscan friar William of Occam it, it states that when competing theories are equal in other respects the simplest one is the best well duh and as I was saying Lulu admitted to killing Logan in front of a whole bunch of people and no one believed her that we know of well, yeah but let's I advise that we stick to what we what we do know Okay, a courtroom of people saw her lose her marbles. Uh, well, what, what about motive? What, what would someone have to gain? This is not about money. When is anything not about money when it comes to you? Clearly, you're feeling better. I'm, so, I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't mean. Yes, you did. But it's fine. I'm a true capitalist. I know a good business deal when I see it, which is why I think we jumped to a bogus assumption. One that really would have ticked Mr. Akamov, who, by the way, picked a pretty lame name for his principle of logic. Hey, um, the bogus assumption, though? Oh, that this is blackmail, because the note didn't ask for money, it didn't even hint at it. I think it did exactly what it was intended to do. Upset you, and make you feel guilty. But who would want to do that? <laughs> if someone sent me these notes to make me worse... It means they want you stuck in this place. Would you stop that? What? I'm centering my chi so I can eliminate unblemished thought. I don't hear you coming up with anything that's useful. That's because you blocked my flow. Okay, no, that's okay. Look, I, I, I need some time to think about this. We all do. 
Um, my therapist is coming in for a session soon, but there's something that I have to go do first. Wait, 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 so. I, I, I vow I'll use all my power to discover the identity of the evildoer. Thank you. Both of you. You guys have helped me more than you know. Don't you go putting your lack of chi on me. Oh. I'm sorry I forgot to sign in properly. Blue's well, condition on my mind. I got a lot going on. Completely understandable. Have a good visit. Thanks.